welcome you to the mountain and invite you to share in our belief that every person shares the potential to grow in wisdom, to discover their unique and independent voice, to nurture others and to engage their communities. The fun and challenging programs we offer foster communications, trust, problem solving, and a deeper spiritual connection while preparing young people to lead and to be supportive and constructive members of a group. South Mountain YMCA camps are more than a series of camping and retreat programs on the mountaintop. They're a way of life, they're a philosophy. It's both exciting to explore and easy to embrace. Today, we're asking for your help to keep those fires burning. I love the counselors, they're really nice. And I love the activities that we do. Um, we do climbing tower, we do archery and BB guns and we hike to the peak. I think it's just to meet new friends and new people, you know, like really experience camp over and over and over again, up until the point where I become a counselor. My counselors were Allie, Amanda, and Rachel, and they were really nice and really funny. They were like always joking around, and they made everything fun and easy to do. Here at the South Mountain YMCA camps, we are best known for our summer camps. Bindenwood Day Camp, our YMCA Camp Conadweiser, which is our sleepaway camp for boys and girls that started in 1948. But we are much, much more. Our outdoor center provides environmental and outdoor education year-round for our many schools here in Berks County, as well as from around the state. Additionally, our outdoor center provides team building programs on our low and high ropes courses for local high schools, colleges, and businesses. Our Duberstein Equestrian Center not only offers riding camps and horseback riding lessons throughout the summer, but we provide riding lessons and trail rides to children and adults in both the spring and fall months. Finally, for our neighbors, our community outreach efforts provide many free family programs like our family fun days, our egg hunt, and our fall festival, and much more. We began our work in Berks County more than 65 years ago as summer camp for boys. Boys of all races, religions, and socioeconomic backgrounds. In the 1980s, we expanded our mission to include summer camping programs for girls, as well as providing environmental education programs for local schools. Now it is the time to truly become a camp for all. When our board of directors first met to discuss this bold initiative more than three years ago, it was clear that this theme, Camp for All, would be our rallying call. It is time to make our facility and program more available to all of our friends and family. Camp for All means that we will welcome all cognitive abilities, all physical abilities, all ethnicities, all genders, all socioeconomic backgrounds, all faiths and all ages. To meet this bold goal of ensuring our future impact and creating a camp for all, we need the community's support on four key projects. Number one, a much needed renovation of our 1948 dining hall that will add restroom facilities to the hall, as well as expanding the seating area, accommodating more diners and increasing the ease of access throughout. Number two, a renovation in addition to our pool complex that will restore our 70-year-old basin to its original glory while adding a second, smaller basin with splash features and a zero-entry design that will better accommodate the young as well as those with limited mobility. Number three, an expansion of the Duberstein Equestrian Center that will allow for year-round riding as well as the necessary facilities for therapeutic riding experiences. And finally, additional facilities and equipment to better serve special populations focusing on the development of the waterfront, program spaces, restrooms, and picnic pavilions at the Martin property, a 60-acre property with a pond adjacent to our existing camp facilities gifted to our organization by the late Marilyn Martin. Archery was my favorite program because I made a bullseye. Well, I remember my first day where I didn't really know where I was because I'd never been to a camp that was so big and spacious and had so many like things to do and I remember when I came to my cabin all my counselors and kids in my cabin were so welcoming. I feel like I have grown. Um, I get to meet people from around the world every single year every time I come back and you get to see the different culture and how on one part of a mountain it all blends together and really just creates just a certain atmosphere that 
you, you can't replicate anywhere else. What keeps me, bringing me back is uh, you know, the staff that are there because they're all there for the kids. They want to work with kids, a lot of them, their field in life is going to be a teacher, um, working with special needs, whatever it might be. They're there for the right reasons, they're there to make the kids have a good time and I keep coming back because I want to see the kids develop and grow, uh, watch them. You know, some are here for three, four weeks and you can see the progress as they go along. Being here for four years now, working with kids my first year, come back, they're 15, 16 years old now, some of the boys, and you see, wow, they've really developed and matured. It's amazing to see. The dining hall project means more space for kids and adults of all abilities to navigate during meals. It means restrooms inside the building so our visitors don't need to leave the facility just to use the facilities. It means breakout rooms and meeting spaces for summer camps, schools, and community groups. It means a much needed renovation to the heart of our camp, the place where everyone comes together. The pool project means better opportunities for people at all stages in life. It means new possibilities for our friends, neighbors, and children with limited mobility. It means a new place for family fun. It means a better place to bring people together for new friendships. The equestrian project means a place for riding students to learn year round. It means a place for adults and children to connect with the beautiful animals they love and one another in any weather. It means a place for all people to grow. It means new opportunities. The Special Populations Project means adaptive program elements across our 600 acres in climbing, target sports, aquatics, and equestrian programs. It means the development of the Martin property and other adaptive programs and spaces that mean new places in our community for at-risk or disadvantaged youth, seniors, people with limited mobility, and those with cognitive challenges. It means the development of special program areas at a single elevation, eliminating climbs and descents experienced when traveling over most of the property. And it means new spaces for nonprofits in Berks County to come together as partners and serve the underserved. Please join us and the growing number of people who are supporting this important capital campaign. Most of us are making a pledge which will fulfill over three years. I know from my own personal experience, that fulfilling my pledge over a number of years, whether it's paid annually or quarterly, allows me to make a more significant gift and consequently make more of a difference. With your support of our capital campaign, South Mountain YMCA will indeed be a camp for all. Thank you for joining us. As you have seen, we are making this a camp for all. A camp for all children and teens, a camp for all young adults, and a camp for all for senior citizens, and a camp for individuals of all ages who are physically or developmentally challenged in some way. Together, and with your support, we can make South Mountain YMCA a camp for all.